Hey, it's Mitch Bartlett at Technopages.com. Got a note color here, and uh, I hear there's a new update for it. So uh, right now, this one's running. Uh, we'll go back here. And device info about your note color. Yeah, got 1.1 there. So. This is what the extra screen looks like. Not much there. No market or anything like that. So hopefully this update will uh, give me some more to do on this thing. And uh, I'm connected to Wi-Fi. It's not automatically updating. They said if this happens, we're to just do a manual update. So that's what I'm going to do. So we're going to go ahead and plug this into our computer. Upside down. Here we go. Okay, we're at the Nook website. And it says we can get the version 1.2 today. We're going to download the file. And I have the copy of the file we downloaded on the desktop already. Uh, note color one two update dot zip and it looks like all we have to do is copy it over to the note color all right All right, we're all done with that, and we can now eject the Nook. Okay, so we got our Nook color now disconnected, files all copied, and uh, now we're supposed to wait for it to just detect the file, and it's supposed to do everything automatically. It's restarting on its own. All right, we're coming back up here. Not sure if I want to read forever. There's just way too much good TV to miss. Yeah, that took about five minutes. And now it's called apps instead of extras. And yeah, look at that.
now we have an option to discover more Nook apps. Okay, I guess I can browse. Apps. Let's see all. All right, so we're all updated. We'll check it. A little bit, a little bit slower since the update. All right, we're version one point two. So that's how you upgrade your Nook to 1.2. And for tips like this and more, visit technopages.com.